We'd been wanting to do virtual reality here at IEPUC for a lot of reasons, but um, you know, flexibility being one of them. So the equipment is uh, SimX AR. So it is a company out of California that does virtual reality uh, programming for health professions. It's very accurate because I work in a hospital and like when we have C. diff patients, like the isolation, you have to practice putting on the gown, the gloves, washing the hands properly. Did my test results come back? Uh, I'm having all this diarrhea. Well, you actually have a condition that's called C. diff, so it actually makes you you have diarrhea up there for a while. I like the aspect that you're communicating with the patient and the family members because that's that's real life. So what medications were you on during the pregnancy? I used pills about a week ago. What pills were they? Do you know the exact name of the medication? I'd rather not say. Oh, okay. I take pain medication. Unfortunately, we do see commonly, and a lot across the country we do, but we do see a lot of that here in our region. And so that is babies born to a mother that um, took various types of drugs and might have some withdrawal symptoms. The purpose of that scenario is not so much around the baby, but more around the mother and how they talk with the mother. I feel terrible. I'm sorry you feel that way. The only part we're concerned about is her fussiness and stuff, so. We're just going to have to monitor her through the withdrawal stages and make sure everything stays on track, but as far as we're concerned, she looks like a healthy baby. Well, actual clinical exposure, live clinical exposure is fantastic. We can't create uh, a situation. So that is the, the big value, is the flexibility. UIT has really got this off the ground for us. So um, Bill Fields, our executive director, was um, the kind of startup communication with this, with, with this company. And they've been really instrumental helping us have the equipment that we need. 